Hi all, let's see how to implement scatter chart dynamically in ASP.NET Core or MVC application using Chart.js in C Sharp. Let's see. He created ASP.NET Core MVC application inside the controller, created a home controller, and inside this controller class created a view scatter for showing a scatter chart. Let's open the view. Inside this view, created a view with the class name text center, card, card header. These are all optional, but add a view where you want to show the chart and create a canvas tag inside that view and provide any ID which you want. And here I provided ID as scatter chart and we have to import jQuery and chart.js file for showing a chart. Here inside the script tag, I added a jQuery CDN and chart.js CDN. You can also provide file link of that. And inside the script tag, get element of canvas tag by ID and assign it to a variable and created a variable data and inside that assign the data set. Inside this data set, provide the label value and inside the data property, uh, we have to provide X and Y values. For using scatter chart, data must be passed as object containing X and Y property. Here, I hot coded X and Y points. After showing a chart with these hot coded values, I will show how to change these X and Y values dynamically from controller. Then provide the background color of the scatter. Create a chart function. Inside that, provide canvas tag ID assigned variable. Here, the variable name is scatter chart. And inside the type property, uh, provide the type as scatter. And data property, provide the data set assigned variable. Here, the variable name is data. Provide that. And provide the options property. These are all optionals. Let's execute and check. Here, our chart the label which we assigned and in x axis the year are showing and in y axis the score to points are showing here the result we can also resize this point size let's see after the background color provide the point radius and point h of the radius value here i am giving 10 you can also decrease or increase the let's refresh and check here the result here i have outputted the values of x and y let's make it dynamically by passing values from controller to view let's go to controller for creating a list, I created a model for student yearly score details. Inside this model, created just three properties, ID, year, and score. Let's create a list for this model. Go to Home Controller. Let's create a list. Here, created a list using a collection initializer syntax for a student score detail model. But in real time, you can take values from database or from any other resources. Let's return this list object to view. Let's go to view and import our model. And here our hot coded values we have to change this as dynamic uh, let's create a, a variable by using for each let's push values to this array here in x-axis and the score in y-axis instead of this hot coded value let's pass our variable here the yes is caps. Let's copy and replace this. Let's execute and check. Here a dynamic value from the controller is displaying. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.